Next up on Juvies, I use my dethatcher to get all this, hopefully, all this dead crap off the top of this area here and so I can put some new sod down. Let's do it. All right, so there it is, 14 inch Greenworks dethatcher, all assembled. It really took a matter of maybe five minutes. Just walking you through it really, really quickly. Um, so the handle is completely adjustable here. So you can adjust it with these little, little handles on the side. And then you also do have uh, this little knob here to adjust the, uh, the height of the dethatcher itself. You've also got this nice little uh, bag here that you can take on and off for the, uh, I guess the clipping, so to speak. And then um, it is also a scarifier as well as a dethatcher. It's super simple, super easy to remove and change from the scarifier to the dethatcher attachment, which it is right now. Literally just this one Allen bolt, the scarifier or the dethatcher attachment comes right off. Screw it back in and that's that. Pretty easy. So all I'm gonna do right now is go and like I said, try to take out that, all that thatch right there in that little spot so I can put some new sod there. But really just to make it go, you just go ahead and plug in a uh, standard extension cord. You push this little green button and at the same time you uh, hold down this guy and then it'll go. So I'm gonna go try it out and see how it works. to make here so I had to empty the little basket probably three or four times just for this little tiny area so obviously it's definitely doing the job and you can see it's getting darker um, the, the soil so basically I'm exposing the soil which is exactly what I want in order to lay the sod down so it's definitely really effective and I had the uh, the Greenworks 14 inch dethatcher on the highest setting so if you really want to get deep, um, you know, into the soil and, you know, do that type of thing, I would recommend even maybe one lower than the top one. But as you can see, it, it is working very well. Just one other quick note is has something not to do that you see me doing in this clip is staying put with the dethatcher on. So you definitely don't want to, especially when you're turning corners, like when you get down to the end of your your row, like turn the thing off or you gotta lift up the front of it so the, the dethatcher is not actively working because that will tear up probably more grass than you want. Again, here I'm really just actually, I'm trying to do that uh, to put new soil down and put new sod down, but if you have a nice lawn and all you're trying to do is dethatch, uh, you definitely wanna turn the thing off after every, after every pass. Then here, I just wanted to show you how much thatch comes out after only two passes. That was two passes on this little spot, this little area. So really, I really filled up like two garbage cans full uh, just in this little area here. Okay guys, so as you can see, there's, there's definitely a lot less, you can see, there's a lot less thatch in here. So, I mean, that's kind of the point. Obviously, this is just dirt. I wanted this just to be dirt. Uh, I wanted to have it pick up all the old thatch so I can just put new sod down but uh, as you can see though in this pile here there's definitely some grass in there but it is mostly just this kind of dead uh, this dead stuff so um, yeah I mean I think just kind of upon an initial review here it did pick up a lot of the thatch and the grass is still there I mean it, there wasn't much before as you saw kind of in that first little clip there but uh, we'll definitely keep using it and uh, yeah but that's kind of a first look at the the Greenworks 14 inch dethatcher.